In the lightweight division at UFC 286, you got a big one here. This is going to be a tough prediction because you got Jai Herbert coming in at 12 and 4, taking on Ludovic Klein, who comes in at 19 and 4. A lot of wins. Now, Herbert, uh, 6'1 compared to the 5'7 Klein, so that's about a 6 inch height advantage for Herbert, in my opinion. 4 inch reach advantage as well, 77 to 73. He fights right handed, but here's where. The differences begin. Ludovic Klein is a southpaw. He lands more significant strikes by one per minute, 3.5 to 2.5. So you figure over the course of a 15-minute fight, it's 15 to 20 significant strike advantage, and Ludovic Klein lands a takedown here and there. But I think he's only landed one in five fights because he had several in one fight. But digging a little bit deeper, which I Herbert first, 55% takedown defense. That's not going to... Uh, quite cut it, uh, especially in this fight. But he's got wins over Kyle Nelson and Kama Worthy. So, okay, two decent wins. But who did he lose to? Ilya Topuria, Renato Moicano, Francisco Trinaldo back in 2020. All by finish, but all against good fighters. Now, on the other hand, Ludovic Klein beat Mason Jones and Devontae Smith. That's a big win in his last two fights. But he lost to Nate Landwehr. And Michael Trezano before that, before, or at the beginning, be Shane Young. So he's three and two. So the first thing that sticks out to me is that Jai Herbert's numbers are low as well at 2.5 significant strikes per minute because he spent a lot of time on the ground or at least was taken down against Ilya Topuria. Five takedowns against Renato Moicano. Uh, Francisco Trinaldo took him down two times. So in three of those fights, he was taken down eight times. So that's why his significant strikes per minute is low. So here's what needs to happen. He needs to defend the takedowns. Keep the fight standing. He should land about four significant strikes per minute. He can he can keep pace with Ludovic Klein in this fight if he can defend the takedowns. And I think that's what's going to happen. I'm going to take a shot here on the underdog, Jai Herbert, uh, to get the win by close decision, in my opinion, in the best division uh, in the UFC, the lightweight division. Here at UFC 286.